Down on the cooler side, specifically looking out towards areas like Mount Pleasant, still holding on to 63 degrees this morning. Gone up a few degrees now out towards Unionville at 65, 63 in Centerville, 64 over in Milan, and then warmest locations, Bloomfield, Macon, and then Lancaster 68 to 69 degrees respectively. So unfortunately we're done with that comfortable and cooler forecast that we had over the weekend. That high heat and high humidity that we got rid of is what's coming on back to the area. So taking a look at what to expect throughout the day today. Temperatures are going to quickly work their way up from where they're at now to 90 degrees by about 11 a.m. to noon and then in towards the lower 90s as we get in towards 2, 3 and 4 p.m. Looking to cap out right about 93 degrees that we see out towards Bloomfield, Memphis, Lancaster, Unionville, as well as Kirksville, the cooler locations. Well, That'll be 91 like areas in Mount Pleasant, Ottumwa, as well as Fairfield. But the heat index value is something we're going to be dealing with for quite a while as well. We do see chances at some increase in cloud cover heading through this afternoon. And then once again tomorrow, that could help bring a little relief as temperatures drop by about a degree or so when that cloud cover makes a big impact. But overall, we're not going to see any type of relief from the high heat and high humidity until we get in towards Friday, late Thursday or early Friday when our next chance for some rain may be. Temperatures tomorrow reaching anywhere from 91 up towards about 95 degrees with warmer heat index conditions tomorrow compared to today. And outside of that, our sky conditions are going to be very sunny with just a little bit of cloud cover cycling on in over the next few days. So we're not seeing any consistent cloudier or partly cloudy skies that could help bring down those temperatures by a little bit. It is just going to be very, very sunny and very hot. Today, the heat index values are going to sit between about 95 to 99 degrees. Taking a look at about noon, the cooler areas still down towards 89. Albia Centerville feeling like it already feeling like 95 out towards Kirksville and Macon and then the warmest is going to be out in towards about 3 and 4 p.m. this afternoon when heat index values get up towards about 97, 98 degrees. So not hitting 100 degrees for the heat index just yet, but we could be seeing that as early as tomorrow. And especially paying attention to Friday's forecast, if it stays this warm and we don't see the impacts from the rain on Friday, we are going to be dealing with heat advisories, heat warnings, excessive heat watches, and things like that as we get heat index, value, heat index values of 100 degrees degrees or more for four consecutive days. That's the requirement you need for that heat warning or excessive heat index to go out. So here's a look at the future cast and like we saw on the future track, there's not a whole lot going on around the area these first few days. It's not until we get in towards later Thursday and early Friday that this cold front starts to set itself up just north of our area, helping add that extra little bit of moisture, extra little bit of fuel to this fire and bringing rainfall chances back to the area by late Thursday. Better odds though is as that cold front falls to the south and that rainfall starts to move in on Friday, but we could be looking at a few days of rain in a row, but right now the chances are very minimal and if we do see any rain, it is looking to be very scattered after Friday because of that cold front passing on through. But now let's go ahead and send it back over to Ella.